name is Joanna Wilson. I'm a cheerleader who has spent a lot of time around cheering on, failing at, and involved in the sport of gymnastics. I love to find new ways to challenge my body, and today's video is no different. I'm with Olivia Smart, aka Olympic Ice Dancer, aka Dancing on Ice Champion 2023, and she is going to take me through her off ice training session. Oh, yeah. That feels good, that's my move. Oh, yeah. Was that you? Now, we're gonna do a lot of uh, like power moves in there. Perfect. Yeah, so that was gonna be my first question. What does training of an ice dancer look like, apart from obviously being on the ice? Besides the art of it, like the performance side of it, when you watch an ice skate and when you skate as you've done, you realize that your legs get a lot of the work. Yeah. So we work on a lot of leg conditioning, activation, power, like being snappy and jumping. It's kind of like gymnastics, but way more leg based and a lot of balance work, which are pretty good at. The first thing myself and Liv did was some lower body focused activation of our muscles. And trust me when I say it was no joke. These exercises look relatively easy, but my legs were burning afterwards. Right, so we're gonna start with just like a little sumo squat where you're gonna sit and you're gonna try and put your bum as low as possible. And you want to keep your feet as turned to the front as possible. Okay, we're just gonna have a little moment here. I'm pretty good at this one. Okay. And you're gonna straighten your legs, oh, bring your yeah. legs back down. Oh yeah, that feels good actually. Okay, and then we're gonna widen our legs. A real sumo squat. And you are going, <laughs> this is one of the weirdest exercises, but we some, I don't know why we do it. Kind of like move. <laughs> Okay. And the hands are yeah. compulsory. <laughs> You've got to do the hands. It's like, it's like kung fu, is it? Yeah, but it's, you know, when we skate, it's like a lot about what you do with your upper body while being like strong on your legs. So we try and incorporate. Okay. <laughs> it really hurts. Yeah. We're going to start off with just some regular squats. So start at the bottom and power up. Go back down, take a sec and power up. And you want to make it snappy at the top. Would these exercises be like every day? Yeah, so it's like just pre pre skating, yeah. Every day, pre skating, pre workout, yeah. and when you get to the top, squeeze your bum. Squeeze. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Now we're gonna do the opposite. We're gonna start top, down, and you're gonna catch yourself at the bottom. Uh, catch. <laughs> we play a game sometimes where you have to call it, and I have to follow you. <laughs> Next one is similar to that. But we're gonna start from our tippy toes. So we start fully elevated, and stay, 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 reach, 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 age, down. Ba, 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 da, da. Like throw yourself down and catch it at the end. Ba, da, is it? <laughs> this is so fun. <laughs> Same okay. thing onto one leg. I predict falling in my future. Give it a try. Shoot, shoot, shoot. And da. that's it. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> Keep your hips level. Ba, ba, up. Da. Nice. Ba, da. I'm getting better at the yeah. up. If you're watching this at home, just stand up from your sofa and just try and do this exercise. Reach for the because ceiling and then just lift. And you've got to stay lift still. It makes it look so easy and it's, it's not. not. So we're going to do some curtsy squats. Okay. So going back. Oh, cool. The hands are an extra feature. You don't have to do the hands. Ash is curtsy squatting behind the camera. Ash curtsy with us. <laughs> yes! <laughs> I'm gonna do two forwards. Never done a forward curtsy before. This one hurts more. Oh hurts yeah! It. Okay, we're gonna do two more exercises that are more static based. One leg, drop. Pop back up, pop back up. Okay. Pop. That's it. That's it. Good ball. Bird, baby, bird. And these are like, I'd say like the activation exercise I would do before skating. But okay. it's also a workout at the same time. Yeah, yeah. Would you ever do these in isolation or is it always just like as a warm up to your skate? No, I'd do these in isolation as well. If I was to go to the gym, I'd do this stuff and then I'd do a lot of plyometric stuff and weights. Another video that I'd, we should do together or workout we should do together is I would do a full arm workout. What's when the I purpose of the arm workout? I'd say Nile. to look yeah. <laughs> But just to have like, you know, the strong base holds that we yeah, have yeah. to have like secure holds and honestly to have nice looking arms genuinely like yeah. as soon as I started doing arm workouts I bulked up a bit and then my arms cut down and now I have the arms I've always wanted and in ice dance ballet and all that your arms really matter, matter. how they look yeah that's interesting so I did it to tone everything down guys we have some mahoosive news the anything is possible if you just work tops are going on pre-order for the whole of Easter weekend. So by the start of May, you guys are gonna be able to get your hands on the tops that we've been wearing for the last six months. I am so, so buzzing. Keep your eyes peeled, 10 a.m. on Friday. 
swiftly moving on to some dynamic movement in the session, prepare to have a little giggle at my terrible coordination. The next one is going to be more plyometric stuff, so more bouncy things. So we're going to go in a straight line and we're going to leap. 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 And then you need to start, like, stay static on the landing. You want to think about going more forwards than up as well. Forwards and through. And Looks now, sick. <laughs> extra added point, leap point. Oh yeah. Go on. <laughs> so that's that, and now we're gonna do double time. So you go one, two. One, two. One, two. Fast, hold. Fast, hold. Yes, we're gonna do this one. Up, 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 up. Squeeze your core when you need to come in. Same style, sideways. You're gonna jump from your right, switch. Switch. Okay. It's a hard one to get. I know you'll get this. <laughs> right, got it, got it. <laughs> Keep your knees in front of you. You like a leprechaun? That's it. <laughs> I'm not laughing this one. Yeah, you are. I'm not. That's it. I'm it. it. So push your legs down and down. <laughs> down. That one needs work, I think. Mm -hmm. Just a little bit. As well as lower body strength, it is really important for ice dancers to be able to maintain a really strong core whilst doing their routines. Let's do some floor stuff. So I'm just going to do a simple tabletop reach. Simple and reach. That's it. Switch sides. You want to do this without moving your hips or back at all. So what my teacher does is she has a stick. <clears throat> she lines it up on my spine. So my head has to go down a bit more and the stick has to stay still. And even if you tilt your hips a little bit, that stick rolls off. You're doing it wrong. I wish you had a stick. Ashley. Not big enough stick. You asked for a stick. For goodness sake. Do you want to try it on mine first? <laughs> right, if Liv can't do it on hers, then I'm not trying it. Wow, yes, that is impressive. <laughs> All right, right we're gonna nice. Start. Opposite arm, opposite leg. You can do this. Yes. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> the fact that you've just done that is so impressive. You can do this. Look how much it moved. You can do this. That's you like... can do that though. Just for context, how heavy this is. <laughs> 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 So we're gonna do a core exercise where we're gonna do opposite knee, opposite elbow. Okay. You're gonna hold Freddie and the Frog. This is usually a yoga block. You're gonna stay here. You don't move your hips or your core. You do it with your eyes and your head. You go to one side and then you're gonna turn your head. And without moving your core and using your hip, you need to get back. To wow. Side. Okay. Use your eyes and your head. It's a massive impact. Go on. Yeah. Yes. Yes, Jay. Oh, squeeze, 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 squeeze. Yes. Squeeze it. Pass the we'll tipping point. We'll Pass the tipping point. Go on. Go on. Go on. Go on. Go on. Keep Freddie in there. Go on. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That is so good. It's it's good. good. That's it. <laughs> Are you using your foot to push off the floor oh, there? Come on. Just, Don't use I, that. Are you using that? Keep it off. Like I've got a sleep paralysis. <laughs> I can't move. <laughs> I'm awake or I'm a dreaming. You like a man who just is stuck in the corner. You can do it. Go, 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 go. Look over your shoulder. Head, head. That's it. So think about squeezing that knee up. <laughs> Here come your beast weight. <laughs> Good morning, Luke. Great to see you. Use your head. Keep your hips parallel. Roll to the side. And then you're going to roll back. You just side eye, midget. Bombastic side eye. <laughs> You haven't even got the frog yet. And then what? Go back? And then you're going to go back mm. without you using your hips, your hips or pushing anything here. You've got to use your head to turn your head and use your core. I might have spoken out of turn, actually. <laughs> I've made a severe and continuous lapse in my judgment. Ow! <laughs> your eyes make a massive difference. <laughs> Stop pushing with your arm! I'm not pushing with my arm. <laughs> <laughs> I did it! You did, yeah. I did it! Last but not least, you'd probably imagine that to stay on your feet on the ice, you do require a lot of balance. Let's see how I get on with the final challenge. We're gonna do a power balance exercise and then we're gonna do more like 
meditating balance exercises. Ready okay. to go join us. <laughs> Can't move your mouth though. Guys, if you're enjoying this video, you really should subscribe. One leg, opposite arm, opposite leg, and you're gonna take your opposite leg across diagonally and you're gonna reach with the other arm. Diagonally. 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 So opposite arm, opposite leg. Reach as far as you can. Back up. Squeeze your right bum cheek. Ball loops. You can tap your toe down at the back. I did it. You come back up. Gold. Nice. Gold. <laughs> anyway, balance. Finish Just me off. Carmen, you're gonna go. Whoa. <laughs> <Right>. Okay. <laughs> so two feet base, shoulders width apart. Close your eyes, and you're gonna react to what I do. Oh god. And you wanna bring yourself back to center. Okay. Shouldn't <laughs> in it. Oh! <laughs> was that you? <laughs> but I was falling off of the planet then. <laughs> well, gravity had stopped working. <laughs> Well, that's a balance exercise, and the other one we do is one foot, close your eyes. Well, okay. stay two feet, close your eyes, slowly bring your foot up. Can we hold our hands? Yes, ready? Thank you so much, everybody, for watching this video. We really appreciate it. I hope you thoroughly enjoyed seeing some of Olivia's ice dancing, conditioning, warm up, and activation exercises. You should, you should try this with a friend at home. This Remember way. to like. <laughs> Subscribe. Oh my god, this is well hard. <laughs> Keep smashing it. And remember, oh, anything is possible. <laughs> Why is gravity not working? Your feature was <laughs> Peace. Ribbit. <laughs> I'm out of shape. <laughs> <laughs>